The new star season alpha 3.18.1 just hit the PTU just about an hour ago and we're going to go straight into the patch notes. The testing focus that they have mentioned here is the new ship delivery system as well as general stability and bug fixes. They also mentioned the caveat here under testing focus 3.18.1 implements multiple new systems that should significantly reduce the strain on the back end which were causing various issues with inventory entitlement and account loading this also accumulates to numerous fixes that have been applied to the live over the last couple of weeks and some hot fixes that were done this weekend to help address the, the 30,009 issue along with a new database when it comes to bug fixes, the issue where players are unable to exit the seats of their ship has been fixed. And when it comes to technical, they have one server crash fixed. But what I want to go through in this video is some of the known issues that they're currently having right now in the PTU. So the first one is the game client may close without a error or crash handler. The ASAP terminals are unusable and fade to black when accessed. Harvestables deposit may be invisible to players causing collisions or become unavailable for scanning, mining, or salvage gameplay. The trams are out of sync with the station timers, causing trams to overlap or not appear on time. Elevators and trams are jittery during transit of player character. I have noticed that myself as well. It also says here players are unable to occasionally exit their seats. They, they said that they fixed that, so I guess maybe they accidentally left that in there from a previous build. When flying near another ship, ship seems to hit an invisible box that kicks it in random directions reclaiming main elevator control panel do not respond to input cargo may be invisible in multiple ships after being purchased that really sucks unable to view ships inventory through knickknacks when attempting to start a refinery job players receive an error saying something went wrong error code 20. security contract evaluation is now re-offered upon failure that really sucks Combat service beacon progress and rating inconsistent on missions. Security work assessment remain hostile NPCs not spawned in. So this causes you to not be able to finish that mission. PTV wheels at the Orison BTR area can clip into geometry and become detached from vehicle. The snuff fighter attached to the constellation lacks interaction prompts to enter, making it unusable. Some ship wreckage erroneously give no material text and do not let you salvage that really sucks markers will randomly disappear after quantum travel with no route set i've noticed this myself the npc coffee vendor is missing from the various coffee to go stalls located throughout stanton you guys already know what to do leave a like subscribe i'll see you on the next video